So uh, one of my favorite uh, singer, songwriters, musicians, you know, ever is Sting. I mean, there's only one Sting. You can never, ever, ever, no other person on earth could sing better, a better songwriter, a better musician. I mean, he plays various instruments, most notably the bass. But, um, you know, when he was with the police and even in his solo career. But um, his real name is Gordon Sumner. Okay. So I was looking up. I just felt like, you know, relaxing. I'm laying back on my recliner. I just had a nice meal. I feel kind of like, you know, nice and full and calm. And I said to myself, you know what I need now? I need nice music. So one of my favorite songs by Sting is uh, English Man in New York, you know? Like, whoa, I'm an alien. I'm a legal alien. I'm an English man in New York. Whoa, I'm an alien. I'm an illegal alien. I'm an English man in New York. Right? Great song. But anyway, he does it much better than me. Um, there's this one particular video, right? Where there's this girl, I guess she's like the backup singer. And she's next to Sting. And he's, it's just, it's not a full band. It's kind of like an acoustic set. He's got a trumpet player and he's playing the guitar and singing Sting. And next to him is this girl with these, don't get upset at me. I got my wife <laughs> right next to me, right? This woman with gigantic boobs, huge breasts. And I'm like, it doesn't seem like she has a bra on, you know? Now, you know when you're not expecting something? <laughs> I'm not, like, I just wanted to hear, like, relaxing music, you know, and I put on, I do a search for English Man in New York Sting. I think the video had something 720. So if you put in English Man in New York Sting 720, you'll probably see this video, okay? So anyway, this woman is, like, bending over. She's like, I don't know, she's moving the mic stand. She's sitting down. She's all over the place. And in almost every single position you see this woman's breast hanging out like like i'm talking about watermelon style you understand and it's like i i can't i'm still kidding man, my poor wife don't you feel sorry for my wife my poor wife it's like i'm trying to enjoy the music <laughs> you know i'm trying so hard i'm trying to relax but i see this woman she's like every <laughs> i'll put it look i'll put it in the um in my community section of the video okay I'll put the link. So if you go to the Ape Father, you know, my YouTube channel, if you go to my community section, I'm going to post this video for you, okay? Check it out. But it's just, it was just so unexpected. It was so funny. It was so, you know, you have to try to understand. I just finished a big meal. You know, I gave this analogy about, you know, again, I have to watch what I say because I didn't say my disclaimer. This is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer. So I just gave this analogy about how one meatball was GameStop, another meatball was AMC, and the big ZD was the corruption. And I showed how working together, we could beat the corruption. And I ate all the big ZD. I ate all the corruption, right? So I'm full now. I feel content. I'm happy. And I said, I just want to, I want to relax. I want me to have a little, little glass of wine I was thinking about. And I want to listen to Sting. I want to listen to English Man in New York. And I was just so blown away because you know when you're not expecting something, did it ever happen to you? This woman's going all over the place with her boobs hanging out. And it seems like, oh, I'm an alien. I'm a legal alien. My backup singer has very huge breasts. Oh, you're not concentrating. You're not listening to what I say. You are focused on her breasts. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you.